was the helicopter, bro. We got the chopper out here. What's going on, boys? We got Grom right here. We at the Fooligan ride out in Omaha. Miserable drive. Yeah, it was like five and a half hours, pretty much six. Yeah, it, we're it, stopping. It wasn't it, wasn't it? And uh, we're gonna do it again tonight, so you know, it's worth it. I'm ready for this shit. I'm ready to do some nasty one-handers. Oh, by the way, guys, I put the cage back on. Uh, Mr. George helped me out with that. We reinforced the frame up here. We welded some thicker plates up there, and then we slapped this thing back on. This cage is an absolute bitch to get on, but it's such a tight fit. I think that's why it's so strong and everything. Now here we go. All right, boys, we get on the ride. Thank you, sir. Woo! Bro, I'm so glad we made this ride. It's been three years since the last one, and we and I didn't ride. I wasn't really stunt riding back then, so it's really cool I can make it to this one. helicopter bro we got the chopper out here and this ride just started too oh my gosh dude my bike can barely go this fast that mini sumo is dope as hell damn skippy we got hella bikes <laughs> the chopper bro Man, the FZ sounds so freaking sexy. By the way, everybody, I am talking to George. If you don't know, he's right in front of me. <laughs> I do need to get that dual uh, mic set up for the Cena, man, ASAP. I don't think I can pull up a third gear right now, but. Oh, this damn engine cage, bro. I can't get it up, bro. This cage is too heavy. Uh, it's not happening. I gotta be in second gear. I can't clutch up third gears anymore with this engine cage on. It's kind of booty cheeks. Back the way of, oh, back away from you. Yeah, when somebody's in a wheelie, you gotta give them your space. I would have told them to back off. Honestly, whenever you're getting real, it, this ride is important. If you go down in this ride and it's a bad, then you might get arrested. And so it's just really good to keep your distance from everybody. And that guy was just kind of riding your ass while you were in a wheelie. I want to take this cage off just because I can't do street shit as well. Killing it. Woo! Ah. Ah. Bro, this damn cage! Oh my god! This road is so trash.
Yeah. I'm ripping a wheelie through here right now. Woo! Omaha, Nebraska, baby. Omaha's not too bad of a city. What's up? That poor old guy, man. Man, Omaha, it's actually a pretty nice little city. Yeah, get it, Dawson. George, um, with how great this ride is going, how much of a good time I'm having, I'm not worried about the ride back at all, man. Like, just thinking about it now, I'm like, I honestly don't care because this was so worth it. We're so worth it. What makes this ride even greater? It, you can look at like everything is so different. Like it's not the same shit all the time. I'm so stoked about this shit, bro. This is what chasing your dreams is, ladies and gentlemen. Yep, 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 yep. Another bike down. Hey, and it was a Z125. Hey, it was another Z125. I tried to downshift it in the first. Woo! Yes, sir. Get it, boy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Sex. Sex. kind of bigger than I thought. Yeah, everything is under construction too. Keep it up.
this ride's kind of fast. Nasty on it, boy. Very curious of how well you guys can hear me because it's so it's it's so loud. So far, no cops. Woo! Yeah, my bike is so heavy now with this cage on. It makes it a lot more difficult for street shit. But the parking lot shit actually helps out a lot. Yeah, bro, it's so nice to ride in a new city for once. It's actually my first time riding in a different city besides, you know, Springfield and Branson and whatnot. Killer. That was bad, I almost ate shit. Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah. One thing I love about it here is there's so much respect here, so like already. All right, boys, I'm not sure when the GoPro stop recording, but I said I was pretty successful so far. <laughs> Legally, I'll give him a nice Legally. little conversation with my foot. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Don't smell my shoe afterwards. Though. All right, I'm gonna get over there and wrap things up. <laughs> Spoogan, how's it going so far? Well, that was the only cop we had to deal with, and luckily he was a nice guy. So yeah. See, everybody follows the rules. We can get away with it. Oh yeah. That was great. Yeah, he seemed good. pretty chill, bro. Thank you, Derek, for uh, letting me know where this spot was. Oh. I'm sure some of you guys may recognize this spot. It was a pretty fast ride, so I couldn't really clutch up a whole lot, in third, especially in third gear, which usually I could, but this cage is, and I need to top and rebuild bad. Figured I'd uh, come hit this lot and do a few wheelies and shit before I leave because I like whenever I used to watch uh, Fooligan and G-Bear when I was younger like probably 14, 15, I'm 18 now but um, I always saw them riding this a lot and I watched tutorials on how to do wheelies here by G-Bear and shit tutorials on how to wheelie so being here is uh, pretty neat but George and I are both kind of tired and we still get a 6 hour drive home so well, it is definitely sick to be riding over here. Once again, I want to thank uh, Derek, Mr. Fooligan, for uh, hosting a damn good ride. Um, we made the news. Yeah, man, it's totally weird. Because this is my dream to ride in this exact lot when I was a kid or whenever I was younger. And so now that I'm actually riding it, it's pretty freaking cool. It's just kind of so cool to see it from my own perspective rather than in somebody else's moto vlog. But yeah, man, I had a damn good time at this ride. It was totally worth it. Um, Chase your dreams, kids. I'm 18 years old. Um, I never thought 
I've always been interested in motorcycles, not a whole lot, but once I saw these mini bikes and shit and stunts, I was pretty hooked. And it's just, I'm really thankful that I can be here right now with one of my good friends, George, Mr. Grummer at 125. And yeah, we're having a great time, man. Never will forget this moment and only more to come because I definitely want to come to Omaha a lot more. Woo! Yes, sir, bro. Ladies and gentlemen, this is why I have this thing on there. So, did my bike fly at all? Oh, my wrist is gonna be so fed up now. I wanted to get in close. <laughs> Alright, anyways, guys. Um. My bike's not staying started anymore. Okay, that's not good. I'm glad I uh, messed my bike up at the very beginning of the night, but um, yeah, something's definitely not right because my bike will not idle anymore. All right, fellas, I'm gonna get off here. Georgie, Grum Rat. Keep it ratty, bro. Yes. All right, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the flip side. Peace out, bro.